How to become a popular blogger. I really want to be a popular blogger. Yesterday I watched one of your YouTube videos where you talked about the water element. I won't go into details but I am currently studying at your school. I did the cleansing and harmonization for 21 days. My elements are fire and water. I have cleansed them so thoroughly that I'm no longer afraid of flying. Thanks to your school, everything in my life has changed. Ksenia Evgenievna, I would like to know what else I need to cleanse and strengthen in order to become a public person. I would like to hope that everything is still ahead of me. Thank you for your advice. Of course, everything is ahead of you. In order to work in this field, you need enough fire, air for eloquent speech, heavy earth to make your words weighty, and water so that the emotional background of your listeners can perceive you adequately arouse a certain interest in people in the form of desire, and not seem dry. But of course fire is the basis, because it's the fire element that's responsible for popularity. But it all comes with experience. The popularity of a blogger depends not only on the way he presents himself. It also depends on the channel he runs. If your channel is original, your content will be interesting to viewers. If it's a compilation copy of what's on all the other channels, you won't be interesting. Speaking of popularity, if you look at the same YouTube, for example, and analyze which channels are the most popular, apart from the music and sex channels, which are certainly the most popular, you will see that the next most popular are the cooking channels. For some reason, women making scrambled eggs for their husbands have millions of subscribers. Why is that? Because this kind of process is always unique, always authentic, always original. It's always a winning option. Whether a blogger shows only his hands without showing his face or not, it doesn't matter. Even tarot card readings are not as popular as videos of someone frying eggs in front of the whole world. And why is that? Because, firstly, there is no repetition in such a process and, secondly, it touches on the deepest and most sensual of human desires. And what's at the heart of human nature? It's sex and food. That is why food bloggers are the most popular and the richest on YouTube. I don't know what your YouTube channel is about, what kind of information you give to your subscribers and listeners, but just remember that it has to be unique, then you will become popular. As soon as you start repeating yourself, as soon as you start giving information that somebody else is giving, you're creating a copy of a copy and it's not going to be interesting. There's a lot of junk like that on YouTube. It is a real dump where everyone copies everyone else. Try never to copy others, try to have your own fire. The fire element is an informational channel. And if you follow these simple rules, popularity is guaranteed. So stay true to yourself, don't humiliate yourself, don't dwell on what you don't understand, and you will find your unique niche, and after that popularity will surely come to you.